Welcome back. It's now time for the Sunday sit down and joining us in studio is the head lady bulldog. It's coach Margaret Richards. Coach, I feel like I haven't seen you since the end of the basketball season, but from what you've been telling me, you've been a very busy lady this summer. Very busy. Uh, we have 90% of our team in summer school right now. So we are doing uh, summer workouts there in school, getting ahead academically. And we also had an opportunity to have some summer uh, camps as well. Awesome, awesome. Let's reflect back upon the 2017-18 season. Compared to your first year, a nine-win improvement, which is definitely on the up and up for a program that you have taken under your wing. Um, how did you feel as far as, you know, seeing those improvements happen from the player standpoint and then from a coach's standpoint? Uh, well, from the player standpoint, I'm, I was glad we was able to make some improvements because we really worked extremely hard the previous summer before, and I know Sometimes when you don't get the results that you want, right. and I want to see them, you know, more wins in the columns this year. Um, but from the coach's standpoint, we definitely was very disappointed that we did not get into the tournament. And that is one thing that we are on our young ladies about because, you know, I think our youth, you know, kind of hurt us with, you know, the lack of experience. Um, but I don't like to make excuses. You know, we are working extremely hard this summer to make sure that change for this upcoming season. Now, one big change you did have from one to two was the depth that you had. I mean, talk about how important that was, having that extra few girls on the bench this year to help out. Uh, that was extremely important. Again, you know, um, with the guard spot, just having the depth that we need because the SWAC is guard-oriented, so mm -hmm. I really... I uh, was happy about that, that we was able to rotate our guards in and out. We really didn't have to play anybody like five, four people, long 30 minutes, you know, per game. So, you know, I felt like our young ladies was fresh most of the time. Can you kind of just tell the Bulldog Nation what they can expect from these um, young additions with your signing class? Uh, well, actually, it was three. It's three? Okay. Yes. yes. <laughs> Even uh, better. Yes, <laughs> Even it better. was three. Uh, well, I would like to talk about, you know, the guard first. Uh, she's the oldest. Uh, she comes from Mobley Community College. Her name is Cornethia Brown. We are very excited about how she will be able to add some experience. She's a very smart basketball player, brings a high basketball IQ, you know, pretty solid. Right. Be able to keep our youth in line a little bit. That's what we really depending on her. Um, our forward position, we have Lucy uh, Chanello. She is from Nigeria. Okay. So we're very, very excited about how, you know, just a tremendous athlete. Uh, she can run run all day. I mean, she can jump. She's a relentless rebounder. She's uh, physical, um, got a great body, you know, about 5'11", 6 foot. She's, you know, extremely aggressive, you know. We have another power forward. We have um, Lazare Saunders. She is from Michigan, okay. uh, Grand Rapids, Michigan. And she is we're very excited about her. She's versatile. She can play, you know, the three and the four. She's about six foot. She recently played in the uh, Michigan All-Star Game and received MVP. And we're very excited, you know, to bring her board as well. Now, Coach, <laughs> a couple months ago, um, you received a very great individual honor, being inducted into the Kentucky High School Athletic Association Hall of Fame. Now, we did some research as well. And if they can pop it up, <laughs> Do you recognize this person? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that was me about a long time ago. Um, mid to late 90s. Yes, 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 mid to late 90s. Um, that was, that, were, that award is just still touching. It's just still unbelievable. Uh, when they, when I first got the phone call in um, November, it just like, you know, just brought tears to my eyes. I mean, just all the hard work. I guess you just never know who's paying attention. And that's why I just always try to tell the young ladies, like, just reach for the stars and just continue to work hard because you just never know. But, you know, going to Louisville Central High School and just being a yellow jacket, that was some of the best four years of my life. And, you know, I always hated losing. And, you know, we did some great things there. And I was able to win they first, you know, win the first sixth region, you know, my sophomore season. Mm -hmm. and, you know, so that that just that was just unbelievable, and I'm very honored to you know get, receive that award. Coach Margaret Rich is joining us in the house tonight on the Sunday sit down. We've got more WZDX Sports Extra coming your way after the break.